You hear that? That sizzling sound. That little snap, crackle, pop. That's Jalen Suggs heating up. By now, you're already familiar with Jay Sizzle's biggest shot. But the crazy part is, Jalen was destined to be a big shot, destroying dudes on the hardwood and gridiron back in Minnesota. One game removed from a perfect season as a college freshman at Gonzaga. And now, a soon-to-be NBA lottery draft selection. At just 19, Jalen has a lot going for him. But to better understand Jay, you gotta know where he came from. I always rep where I'm from. 651, St. Paul, Minnesota. <laughs> Born June 3rd, 2001 in West St. Paul, Minnesota, Jalen Suggs was the first of three children from Mother Molly and Father Larry. Now the Suggs name may sound familiar to some of y'all, that's because the Suggs family has been dominating the Twin Cities area and national stage for over 50 years. His dad, Larry, played basketball for Woodbury and in junior college. His cousin Ricky was runner-up for Mr. Basketball in 1980 and played in the Canadian Football League. His cousin Raina currently plays at Weber State. And his most famous cousin, Terrell Suggs? You know, 2011 Defensive Player of the Year and two-time NFL champ? The Suggs family got some good genes, let me tell you. And that innate talent was found in Jalen at a young age. Jalen could stick handle a hockey puck at four played football at the sixth grade level at age eight and dunked his first basketball at 13. When he was 15, Jalen tried out for the varsity soccer team just on a whim. Coach knew a little about him at the beginning of tryouts, but was completely blown away by the raw talent Jalen had and offered him a spot on the team after day one. That's what I call naturally gifted. Larry saw this gift in his son from a young age and pushed him to compete in all sports. Eventually, Jalen honed in on two, football and basketball. As a QB, Jalen led SMB Wolfpack to a state championship in his junior year. Overall on varsity, he threw for over 3,700 yards and 37 touchdowns and ran for more than 1,500 yards and 20 touchdowns. He didn't want no smoke, dog. He didn't want no smoke. He also got busy on the defensive side, too, nabbing 13 interceptions and bringing two back to the house. As a five-star recruit, man was getting looks from Ohio State, Georgia, and even Nick Saban at Bama. He was even gracious enough to let us follow him on his football journey with his own overtime docu-series, Dual Threat. I'm Jalen Suggs, three-four athlete from St. Paul, Minnesota. This is what I do. As a point guard, Jalen was just as dominant. He got called up to varsity as a seventh grader and was straight cooking dudes that were years older than him. He started varsity as an eighth grader and led his team to a state championship as a sophomore. Then again as a junior and again as a senior. That's back to back to back, baby. Overall, Suggs led Benny Ha Ha to 111 and 15 record during his high school basketball career. He finished as the school's all-time leading scorer with 2,945 points. Sheesh! And at the end of the season, he was named Mr. Basketball and Mr. Football in the state of Minnesota. First athlete to do that in Minnesota, ever. Some other accolades while in high school include Max Prep's Male Athlete of the Year, McDonald's All-American, and three-time gold medalist for Team USA. Suggs was the big man around town. Not to mention, there were some other ballers around town too, including class of 2021 top prospect Chet Holmgren and women's basketball phenom Paige Beckers. All three are major competitors. They push each other to get better on the court non-stop. But they're also best friends and help each other through tough times. For example, when Jalen was going through a shooting slump early in the tournament, Paige FaceTimed him from the women's NCAA bubble in San Antonio. She told him shoot or shoot. And well, let's just say Jalen kept shooting. Football may be over, but my journey's just beginning. Once Suggs put the football aside and committed to the Zags to strictly focus on hoops, it was game over, y'all. You could really see his all-around game. He wasn't just an athlete who could dunk on the break. Man is an all-around point guard who can lead a team and drop some serious dimes. Jay racked up all kinds of awards in his lone year at Gonzaga. WCC Newcomer of the Year, WCC All-Freshman Team, 
WCC Tournament Most Outstanding Player. We're gonna need a bigger trophy case for this guy because next up is the NBA Draft and a whole new journey awaits. Jalen is predicted to go top five on essentially every draft board, and my boy is ready. Ever since I've been a kid, you know, I've just been imagining myself in that moment, hitting the big shots. He's about to set the league ablaze. It's been your favorite storyteller over time, Cambo. I gotta get out of here now, though. Later. Y'all swear y'all could guard me. I don't think so. Y'all need to watch these videos, though, right here and subscribe. Then maybe you could guard me.